Well, Fred's all taken care of. Good. What are you doing? Uh, doing the report on him. I'm also trying to keep Madison Knorr's name out of it until I, uh, until my dad lets us know what to do. What else are you writing in there? What? Come on. Oh, oh, I get it. Let me guess. Impertinent cadet ignores experienced officer and pursues a no percentage hunch instead of doing important police work. Is that right? Uh, point is, procedure is it. When you're a cop, you can't just walk around doing whatever you want to do. Oh, yeah, you know what? Kind of like uh, when you went off solo to find Kendall Slater. That was a totally different situation. Uh, you're the boss. You're the boss. You know, Donut Cart rolled by a few minutes ago. Why don't you go uh, get us a snack or something? Okay, I'm on it, boss lady. Is JR still here? No. Um, uh, he had to take a little A home and for bed. But look, <laughs> I found all these ornaments from when I was a kid. Do you want to help me hang them? Oh, thank you, sweetheart. I, I really just need to be alone with my thoughts for a while. Sure, yeah, whatever you want. Uh, I guess I'll uh, go to bed. Okay. <laughs> oh. I love you, Dad. We all love you. You have no idea how much I love hearing you say that. Yeah. Oh, uh, on, your, on your way out, would you mind turning on some of these lights? I, I, uh, my thoughts want to have uh, some time alone with the tree. <laughs> Take care, Randy. I'll take care of things here. I can't walk away, Dad. Madison's holed up at the Miranda Center terrified. I just can't walk away, not after I nearly killed her in that accident. That wasn't your fault. Maybe. Either way, she made sure we had the evidence that could have put Randy away. Actually, it was her father that gave us that evidence. Well, it was Madison that made the first move. Right before I ran her into a tree. The point is, is that she was there for us when it counted, and I'm sticking by her now. You know what? The minute that you showed me that help note that she passed you, I told you to drop it. Well, I guess it's too late now. Frankie? Not quite. Frankie told you that I was here? He had to. But he doesn't know that I came. I'm here to help. Now you have to leave. I did not want to involve you or Look, your family. There's something that you need to know. I was at Confusion tonight and I ran into your father. He's looking for you, Madison. Oh, God. You, you can't let him know that I'm here. He can't find me. You have no idea what Look, he's capable of. I heard your side of the story. It sounds horrible and I agree. You need to get out of here. How can I do that? I can help you, but we'd have to move fast. Will you let me help you? 